everybody, and welcome to How to Make Your Wife Happy and Healthy, Starving College Student Edition. The mantra for these episodes is to make foods that are cheap, fast, and tasty. Because there are times in our lives, like when you're living in your mom's basement, that you don't want to spend a lot of time in the kitchen because you don't want to have parental contact. And you want to save your money because you're trying to move that girl down the street. Yet, you still want something tasty in your own home. Well, if this describes you or something you know, then watch as I take out a staple from my college days and show you how to make it. Want to know what it is? Well, come on, everybody. Let's slap together a cheap, fast, and tasty meal. like you'd like to have a nice little steak sandwich, as well as a more healthy dish, which had chicken, basil, goat cheese, and sun-dried tomatoes. Oh, it looks so tasty. I'd love to have it myself. If you want to shout out in my next video, stay tuned to the end, or skip ahead. They both work, and find out how. This cheap, fast, and tasty recipe comes from a former roommate of mine. Yet another one I've stolen from somebody. I promise you I'll have some of my own a little bit, but this one is very good because it's very tasty and more healthy than the other ones. But you're gonna have to step up your game because now we're gonna actually do a little more with vegetables. It's gonna be a hummus deli vegetable wrap. It's very tasty. Here are the ingredients. About two tablespoons of hummus. One flour tortilla. This is a leftover flour tortilla from El Pollo Loco. So I don't recommend doing El Pollo Loco because that's a lot of money, costs a lot, but you know, if you have leftovers, gotta use them. Some deli meat. I've got oven roast jerky here, but you can choose whatever deli meat suits your pleasure. Half a bell pepper. Two stalks of green onion. A couple leaves of lettuce. Half a Roma tomato. First thing you're gonna do is take our tortilla and spread on the hummus, about two tablespoons worth. You can add more or less if you like. Whatever flavor of hummus is good. So pour, the, put the hummus right on the tortilla. That's a good amount. Wipe off the knife on the tortilla. Get as much of that hummus on there as I can. I'm gonna take a few slices of the deli meat and lay it inside. Now you can choose whatever deli meat you like. You can also choose whatever vegetables you like. They're all good. Remember, we're doing this cheaply, so I, again, am using just standard table knives. And that's how I'm gonna cut the vegetables. These vegetables, we can make sure they're washed first. Turn all the vegetables through the water. Now it's time to cut them all up. I'm gonna start with half a bell pepper. Okay, we're using a standard table knife. Remember, this is cheap. Looking for cheap methods. Oh, that's right, for the bell pepper, there's lots of stuff we like to take out from the inside. So I'm going to save that one for later. Best way is just to put it, wrap it up in a bag. So again, take a Ziploc bag, put in the vegetable you want to save for later. Sit up tight, take out as much air as you can. There it is, just gotta save it for later. Take out the inside, so we take out the inside, I peel off the top, and then peel out the ribs before slicing. 
Make sure you get all the seeds out. We're gonna take all the seeds out and I'll be right back. Since it's a bell pepper, you can just use, since it's bell pepper, you can just smooth the seeds out with your hand. Because bell peppers are not gonna hurt your hands. Not like a jalapeno might. So you can see I can just use a standard table knife to cut through my vegetables. Don't even have to buy a fancy cutting knife. If you really want to use a quarter of bell pepper, you can use less bell pepper, you can use more. However much of bell pepper you like. So I'm going to use half. It's one of the crisp vegetables. So bell pepper is for the crispiness, lettuce is for crispiness. You use your own vegetables. Zucchini would be for soft and taste. I'm going to use bell pepper. Put it all into my wrap. And you can see my wrap's going to turn more into a taco. Gonna be too big. Hold all of it. Hummus is also for flavor. The lettuce itself was washed. I didn't really dry it very much, but you can dry it with paper towels if you want to. Add some lettuce for more crispness. And then tomato. Probably not gonna use all of it. You know, and you can put into plastic bag. If you want to peel your tomato first, you can, but that takes more work. So I'm not even bothering to peel, I'm just going to cut slices. Now Roma tomatoes are easier to cut. Another tomato, especially since they're not usually as soft. Usually more of a firm tomato. I'm going to cut up all my tomato slices. We'll be ready with that one. There we go, take out the ends. A half our tomato inside. Again, wrap it up into a plastic bag and save it for later. Or you can make yourself a second one if you're a little more hungry. All right, the green onion. So I like the stock part, this part. I'm gonna cut this up, long slices. As you get near the bulb part, you usually slice them smaller. Most of the flavor is in the bulb. The top part is mostly peppery, the bottom part is more, more oniony flavor. So if you were wondering, this bottom part is where most of the onion flavor part comes from and the top part it's more of a pepper flavor. This is what's going to go into my wrap. So here's another cheap, fasty, and tasty meal. You can see how fast it was. Didn't spend much time at all preparing it. All the inside, the onion parts for flavor. Lots of flavor there. Whew. You can see my tortilla can barely hold it all. But there it is. Quick, fast, and tasty. So as I look at it, it's really packed with a lot of vegetables. Maybe it's overpacked. You might need a fork to eat with it, but it's supposed to be a wrap. I put in too much. It's quite a wrap. So we're going to try and wrap it up and eat it as it is. Now let's do it again. I'll use less ingredients. There we go. There we go. Is able to hold it? So if you extra ingredients are outside, that's okay. I can add them in as I need to. Very fresh, very delicious, especially if you are a fan of hummus. Mm. 
Very tasty. Quick, cheap. So you saw the cheat, you saw it fast, and now it's tasty. It's very good. Sorry for the noise yesterday, but since you made this far, go ahead and chop down that like button just like I chopped down my deli wrap. What a tasty delight that was. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to be notified of all my new videos that come out on Mondays. And just to mess with those who don't watch the outro, go ahead and slip the word PESTO into your comments down below. And in doing so, you may get a shout out on my next video. Thanks for watching. Have a happy and healthy day.